Salama leo ku jamaa inakwana ku inagejia monsake dawa ko inakake ko de sape ko de rana mona gesheka wannan radio biafra ausa service a monsake zoa in de muke pada za modinga zoa ko woni loko chi modinga ka muku magana modinga pada gaskia Mudinga toto na asiri wanansi mutani wende suke saa ya Nigeria achikin taloche. Wende suke kao damwa akasan Nigeria. Mwusa ke dawa domumu yi magana, domumu hadojuna, domumu sing avundi ya kamata muyi. Mumbaku alkowari kuwe ni loko chi kama hiyo nzu za mudinga dawa, za mudinga shugu. Za mudinga shugu do mumu yu wana magana, isha Allah. Za mudinga shugu do mumu tona asiri wana sumu tani wande su, suka geni kansu akang mba subani vamu. Shiasa muna nang. Wanan radio biafra ausa service. Radio biafra ausa service. Two. Dege platform na radio biafra London. Megida mo monsenshi. Metemo ko megida mo sunanshi. Mazi uche mefo. Ankuma sunan megida mo mazi namdi kano. Shine shigoban kasa na mutanin Biafra ni kuma sunana wacineke na gesheku na gesheku na gesheku Kazani, 
Jesus ya hudu ya ufakana ta kisa ga kowa dan ka bunza ban ka kaje ka karfo aiki ikun suwawa kaje ingila har amurka da lanjan kai ba utar suwawa kamar Allah ka dike sa Allah a dusharitan su ka bi kazami ka bi kazami kafar Allah ku taki kai dai ka zama su za su kai ka a wannan in bashi ka ba juna ya <laughs> kinta akwai matsala ba ku an kare ta dan ku turu ba a ya bai shi ya girma da ya za a ba ya yani shi ba baba hari mahaukaci ne baki na da ibai fada ba mahaukata ba suna challenge dan hauka ta su ba ta kai ba dan shi ga ta fada da kowa har Allah ba a bai bari ba Salamu alaykum jamaa Wanna radio Biafra Ausa service Nabiu Kafum muchiga ba zemu ya duwa We have to pray to commit everything into the hands of God. When I do a zamu ya turenchi, kuma a zamu hada shide hausa. Ubanjiji Allah mungu de maka, mungu de maka de rende kabamu yo, mungu de maka de kumi de kumi. Father, we thank you, we bless you. We glorify your name. Be that we exalted, Abba Father. We thank you for the life you have given to us. Father, we thank you for your protection. We thank you for your guidance. Heavenly Father, as the scripture said in Romans 9.16, that it's not of him that will it, of him that run it, but of God that showeth mercy. You are the one that giveth mercy that we will be alive. It is by your mercy that we are not consumed. Father, we thank you for this mercy. We ask you, O oh Lord, that this mercy will continue in our life. Abba, Father, for all our listeners, we commit them into your hand. We ask you, Lord, to extend your mercy into them. You say, I will show mercy upon whom I have decided to show mercy. Lord, we ask you, Lord God, Jehovah, continue to extend your mercy. Even when we are not faithful, please, Father, show your mercy upon your children. We are like that fish in the water that cannot deny sin. But we ask you for your mercy. Pardon us, Lord. Have mercy upon us. Protect us. Father, we commit our leader, Mazin Namdekan, into your hand. Lord God, Jehovah, you are the one that called him unto this work. It's not easy for him, but by your grace, Abba, Father, Jehovah, he will be able to do, to accomplish this assignment which you have given to him. Protect and guide him, Lord. Always use wisdom, knowledge, understanding, Lord, to shower him there and night. Father, protect his family. Father, wait his deputy, Mazu for protect them, Imotu Redeemer, protect them from every attack of the wicked, spiritually and physically, and also to every IPOB officials, from head of the directorate, to the coordinators, to the unit coordinators, working assiduously for the restoration of Biafra, day and night, Lord. Father, we pray for your protection over their life. May you protect them. May you be with them. Heavenly Father, whatever needed, make it to be available. You are that God that give it. My Lord and my God, we commit our struggle into your hand. Lord, we ask you, ancient of the day, that you protect Biafra's struggle. That within a short time, Biafra will come, O oh Lord, that your children will go home. Father, we commit ourselves into your hand, O oh Lord. We pray that your wisdom will bestow upon us that we will be able to keep on telling the truth to your people and give them the listening ear to hear this truth, Lord. Abba Father, 
that indeed the light will shine into this darkness and your name and your name alone will be glorified. Thank you, blessed Lord. Thank you, Abba Father. This we pray in the mighty name of Yeshua HaMashiach. Amen. Tojama mungu de muku, mungu ma mungu de ala, de rende ebamu, toyoku, muke pito, muna so musa ido a chicken abunde ike faru a Nigeria. Akwe abunde ya faru a Nigeria, shekara 1804. Na so yima gana in the fula tanchi suki chigu Nigeria. Fula ni ba asaleng mutani Nigeria bani. Badan kasan Nigeria. Suke shigo. Kuma asaleng awsawa asaleng bawushe. Na Nigeria. I'm mutum kriki ne. Suke, suke bude musu kofa su shigo. Suke shigo. Ashe suna. Abunde suke de shi azu chensu. Ay ba abunde. Abunde suke padaba ki ba abunde suna de shi azu chensu. Suke shigo geri. Aka bude musu suke shigo geri. To shigo wangeri ne aka chenja kumi. Yenzu wanan damuan de faru as a 1806. Dege 1804 zuwa 1806. Shine ike faru yenzu. Kowe ni lungu. Kowe ina yenzu an Nigeria. Ba mugani abunde ike faru. Ana pada security uh, uh, abunang security abunang a Nigeria yenze. Wanang magana security abunang berimu shi pada gaskeng. Berimu padang aseleng gaskeng. Pula nine suke yung wanang abung. Suke shigo de genane ba museni ba. Wanang su sunan su boko haram. Wanang su kuma sunan su hesmen. Wanang su kuma sunan su gunmen. Ama do when they have come, look again at TV, look again at Facebook, do cancel, pull an in. To yen zu, mune, asalen yan kasan nan kasan ne. Mune ga mun gani, abonde ike faru, mune ga mun gani, we, wanan abo, when they para, a 1804, shine suna so yen zu su, Su konka kwa ina. Su doka kasang Nigeria gabadea. Su kore aseleng dan kasang Nigeria. Yenzu. Baraka ea gani. Why ene bawushe na Nigeria. Who is awesome man in Nigeria yenzu. Hardly. Keka defreshating. Hardly kache. Gashi kazi kaza. Kwa ina polani. President polani. Military polani. Dukansu. Ama aselendan kasan Nigeria su bang aselendan kasan Nigeria bani. Shine muke yin wana magana abunde shine aselen magana wende zamu yin. Yo, domung idon kowa ebude. Domung kuma monseni me ne zamu yin. Ga security issue. Ana kashe mutani kamang. Kwa kwe ama ba kashe haka ba. Kavunka kashe akwea zeka sing. Zeka sing delilin de kana kashe wana akwea. Baraka pito kagene akwe ya kajiyanka shikowe abanza. Ama gamuta ni ana. Kuma duku wenda na kashi ya Nigeria. Dankasane. Asaleng indigen. Na kasangne. Dege arewa zuwa kudu. To shia saa. Muna so mupara yima gana do munga skie pito. Kowe seng kensa. Kowe seng inde ike. Kowe seng abunde ike faru. Na geni weni tweet. When the line Muhammad ye yi, yache we buko haram bakazaba, bakazaba, kwa na kimbaya, aka yi, shigobanka san Nigeria, when they mutu, General Buhari, yenzu muka geni weni mutu maweje nkuma, mesu na Jibrin, al Sudani, aka yi mushi interview, ana tambesa, mene kaza kaza kazi ke faru, yache we, wena nsumuta ni wende suke yi, father Alibia, Yakin, yakin Libya when the muke sene haka yitung uh, uh, Shakara 2012. We sune suke dawa wa. So na so sushiga Nigeria. When I say again, when is it tash is it you want magana nashi? When is it tash is it you nashi? You duk up, duk up on the ike so. Kuma duk magana ndesuke yi keriane. 
Sun sen gasken ama basu so so pada. Apokina shia sa. Muke shigo yo kuma. Domu muduba. Domu mu san santa. Abunde ike varu. Mugen gasken. Kene dan kaza. Kene dan ariwane. Kene aselen bawishen. Ama yenzo baka sen kankabane. Baka sen inde kake. Ankure kanan. Ankure kanan. Ankure kanan. Ana yodreka de adini. De seasa. De komi. De komi. Ana kani. Ke baka sen kankayenzi. Ama ideng zaka bu de ido. Kunenka. Akang radio biafra. Na house service. Kaji aselen gaskia. Wende ana pada. Apokina. Yangwana. Shine zeka sen. Aselen gaskia. Zeka gane gaskia. Domunka sen. Uh, 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 abon de zakayi. So but when they buy the gaskia, buy the gaba, wallahi na gya maka, mbaka de gaskia, baka de gaba. Aman zen kan sen gaskia, zeka, zeka sen, ko akwe hanya anang ne, ko ba hanya, awurin de kana sake. To yenzu, jine muke bude, wanan radio, muche gaba, mu yima gana. A, a wanen, Aminti kadang zamu para bude line namu Domunke nkana jimu kana suka ayi call Zeka iya samemu Beri mbaka wana nlamba yenzu Beri mpadashi kafun aboki nasu shiku Suyi magana nasu Beri mpada wana nomba Zem mpada de au sakuma Zem mpada de turenchi A turenchi Plus one eight three two six three seven three four nine nine. Zen sake fada kuma aturinchi. Plus one eight three two six three seven three four. Nine nine. Aosa zem fada yenzu. Plus daya bokwe uku dua shida uku bokwe uku hudu tara tara. Zen sake fada. Plus daya. Takwas, uku, dua, shida, uku, bokwe, uku, hudu, tara, tara. Shine lamba nde zeka samemu awasop kowe, awasop kowe. Wana lamba zeka samemu awasop kowe. Shine zeka kriya ba yenzuba hanya bebude ba. Ama mbunde nka kilia za mbaka hanya kai magana nka. Ama yenzu zen shigo zen mbunde hanya abokina su shigo. Malan isa ya na nang kuma malan shetima ya na nang. Na genu kuma malan yakubu. Degi ningi zen shigo kuma eye magana. Abokina na roke ku kubude ido nku. Karaka geni kama muna zage kwa wane. Aa. Gaske ya haka ike. Kulun kulun zen dinga pada. Gaske ya ze zo maka weni loko chi akan ana zage nka. Haka ne gaske ya ike. Ama iden, iden kanade zuchi yang gaske ya achiki nka. Zaka ea gane. Wawe gaske ya ne wana ike pada. Bawe zage bani. Ama mutu mbeki nchiki. Shine bare gane bawe gaske ya ne sobo de. Wana abung ya shafe shi dewa. Sobo de shi mbeki nchiki ne. Ama iden zuchi yanka yana feri Ama ya shafeka Kana jim maganang Kana jim maganang Zaka duka, zaka ida Ba muzonang ba mu Muzage kuwa Ba muzonang ba mu Sada mwa kuwena Ama muzo mu bude gaskia Akang abunde ze kuwe gaskia Zamu chile wanabung Mu bude wanang gaskia Amu tabatara gaskia ya pito de feli Sobo de damwan de muke chiki yenzu Sobo de brashin gaske ya ni Shi ya sa Kuma idu mwya mbude Yenzu muna chiki 21 century ni Wanan loko chi awakening 
Loko chin tashi wane. Kowa yana tashi. Kuma dole neka tashi de, de, de wuta. Dole neka tashi de, 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 de wuta. Ka tashi de gani wa. Dole neka tashi ka gani. Abu ndiki faru. Dole ka tashi de gaskia. Shi yasa muke zo. Yezu zin fara. Ka malam Isa Muhammad. Aseleng abokina. Malam Isa ya yimana aiki. Shekara 2018. Loko chin de muka short wave. Loko chin de muke short wave. Bala isa, kana nang, kai magana, kakeshe jama. Kadaru <laughs>
ara akiba ga abaca irin aikin ta suka yi a rana to jama'a mun dawo muna kan shirin shirin shigowa malam Isa da malam Shitima amma ina ganin hanyan su bai yi daidai amma muna kan jiran su za su shigo amma kan muna jiran su akwai wannan su magana wanda ya kamata mu yi amma kafin wannan magana zan saka kirya lamban da zaka iya same mu kai maganan ka a zan fada da Hausa kuma da Turinci plus 183263734999 plus 183263734 plus 183263734999 hausa plus daya takwas uku dua biu shida uku Bokwe, Uku, Hudu, Tara, Tara. Shine lamba ndezaka samemu. Shine lamba ndezaka samemu. Iden kana soka kriya yinzu, zaka iya kriya. Zemo vude maka hanya. Kuma kang muna vude maka hanya, muna chingaba, muna jira mala isa. Mala isa yana de magana ndeze gya ma. Kuma mala de mala nshitima. Shi ya saa za mubasu wanang loko chi domongu sushiria akang iska yana damu hanyansu. To, jamaa, ya kamata mu dinga gani avundi ike faru anenjea. Yenzu, ya dede anakang wana magana weshi gobanka sang aiba dan nanjeria bani. Kuma ideng nkuke geni avundi ike faru anenjeria yenzu, wana ze gia maka we e abundi Megidan Ipop Megidan Shigoban Kasan Nang Kasan Biafara Mazi inandi kanu Yana tapada adunia Yana tagia ma Kuwane Gaskiani So wada ideng Shi wanang mutum Wende kuna geni Yo Zaka genshi de para Gove kuma zaka genshi De beki Jivi kuma zaka genshi Yazuma young boy Yazuma Kremi yaru Wana kuma zaka genshi Ze chenja Shi wanam mutum, shi wanam mutum, genin mutum haka ne zeka gane we shi ba baseleng jenera buhari wendeka za kwe loko ching. Kuma, iri abondike faru a Nigeria shi ne ze nuna maka forina ne in church. Forina ne shigoban kwa san Nigeria. Shi ya sa, paru wansu de kashe kashe nde ake yi a Nigeria, paru wansu de damuan Nigeria, Aikin suze domung aka akashe mutani yankasa ni Nigeria kuma akawo wenan su mutani wende ba museni ba. Iru wana nghali, iru wana nghali ze nuna maka. Ze gya maka we de gaskia, de gaskia buhari yare yare su. Bashine aweje ngbane. Bashine. Ama damwana de mu yankasang damwana de beki mpata kaman kukula mu beide de bane kaman muna de damwana kukula shi ya sa to yenzu muna de weni wendike kriya mu beremu bude mu shihanya 
הגיע מונו מגנה. הלו? 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 תן לו סיונים, and where you are calling from. כבדה סונן קאה דה אין דה קאקי קליה. הלו? הלו. הלו, יא, גון, גון. Just listen direct from your phone. Off your device. Don't listen from your device. Listen direct from your phone. Okay. One thing, yeah, 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 Peter. So, she has some muna, uh, muna kang magana mugia muku avun de yike faru. To mung iru one thing hali when de yike faru yin. She neze bude maka ido. She neze kai dade shigo bankasang biafra. Mazi inan di kanu we one thing butun when de kuka kriya shigo banku bashibani. Kuma irun kashin kashin de aka yi a Nigeria yin zu when de fula nisuke yi de kansu. Ze kia maka we wende kana kira shugobanka aiba shibani yari ga yari su. We ni mutum ni. So vode vangende ya mutum ya babaze zona ana kashe mushi yara ana chimushi zani yara ana lala te kasansa ze yishuru. Vare yuba. Vare yuba. Tua voki na shia sa voki pitu de fili do momo padagaskia. Iden kedang anla ni karaka jisoro kwa mene kafata gaskia karaka jisoro duk inde kana magana ngaskia karaka jisoro kumi karaka jisoro kumi kafata gaskia sobo de anla to bero mudo kwa wanang wanang call hello tell us your name and where you are calling from kaki amana sunanka and in dege inde kana fada Inde kaka kiri amu. Hello? We lost the call. We lost the call. So jaba, shi ya sa mune yu wana magana. Yaka mata ido mwebude yenzu. Sobo de avonde ze sake faru guove. Ze fi avonde ike faru yo. Ama yenzu muna de loko chinde zamu iya. Securing Gerimu, kasamu. Akan wenansu wende vamoseni ba karasushigu. Duba avunde ike faru. Avunde ya faru akaduna. Duba avunde ya faru. Duba avunde ya faru. Abenwe. De wende suke faru. Agwombe. Daga. Adamawa. Daga yove. Daga zamfara. Duba inda haka kashe mutani. Mwana mba magana adini kowe. Sobo de suna de weni different motive. Suna de weni abu azuchi ensu. Akama kasanka adoka. Amere de kei bako akasanka. Ama bako ezoma dan kasa. Shine aikinsu. Abunde suke suki suyi. Ama sobo de anri gampata. Sobo de anri ga ampata zuchi emu. De wenan suwa bo de siyasa. Na Nigeria anri ga ampata zuchi emu. Shiyasa. Nweni yata shiyapa da gaskia. Inde ike. Baramo yeda de gaskia. Sobo de kamayi yenzu mutum dege. Kasang ibo. Kwa kasang yoruba wa. Sutashi supada gaskia. Baraka yedaba zaka chewe nyamilini. Kwewe shi berebe ni. Sobo dani ga mpata azuchi yanka. Ama gaskia ni. Gaskia ni shi mutumdi ngike vada. Ya dede tun 2013. Mazi inandikanu yana yuwana magana. Gabunde ze faru. Wena nsumuta ni. Amidu bed vasu yedaba. Ama yenzu kage ni. Avundi ike faru. So, she has a muke sake wana magana, muke kao maka wana magana agidanku avokina. Ke kana zamfara, kana sokoto, kana kaduna, kana yove, kana borono, aseling kasankakena, 
Asselen ancestral area na babanka. I can handle maka over. Ama when is it she go take when you worry when the bamoseni ba? Is it yakeka akureka wedding? One avong yenzu kareka duba baki when dike yi magana kachi we she adini mubadaya bani ah iyari mubadaya bani kaza kaza ah ah kani magaskia ideng abunde ike fada gaskia ne avoki na kabishi so but the wedding ne zaka samu ah um ah um gaba. Zaka samu ching gaba. Duba irin kashin kashin dana kashi awsawa azamfara. Wanang godu wende suke echire, wende suke mining azamfara. Aya kamata, it belongs to indizin of nazamfara. Ama zaka geni weni, dege weni wuri ne wende baka zeni ba, iyarin suma baka jima, baka gani nsu bakuma, viska nsu bambanchi de irin naka. Za zwa ya kisi. Sobo de suni ka sun samu yangwa a Nigeria. Wenen sun su yangwa su suni ka sun yi shigoba. Wenen sun su yangwa su suni ka sun zoma majelesa. Yang majelesa a chikin gomenenti na Nigeria. Shi yasa zaka tashi. Ka kwemba yang IPOB. When the me shigobanshi me chingabanshi mas ina de kano. Duk abunda kap gyamu kukuida. Ba we ana so kwe yu wene abune wende baka so a a tamakenka ike yi. Ana so tamakeka. Ana so tamakeka. The ungu be so bodi abunde e faru kwana kimba ya bare sake faru kuma. So bodi ide ya sake faru yenzu abokina generation naku. Chingaba naku. Ze gani, ze kare gabadea. Ze kare gabadea. Duba plato yenzu. Wanansu local government a plato yenzu. Dege wase, dege inani pitozu wa yelowa shandam. Yenzu, ba aselen kasanga wejeng. Wanansu muta ni dege inani, wanansu pulani. Wende de, su bayan kasan Nigeria. Su reka sun shigo, su ke doke kasang yenzu. Ama loko chindana yu wana magana kuwaze shewe kaza kaza newe nyamari ke yu mazana suna so suraba na njeria kaza kaza yu wana magana yuze ya shapeka. Ba ya shapeka ba kaberu gwona nku kaberu haraka nku kaberu asane koye nku kaberu musu wenine. Yuze abunde suke nima yuze jos ne na kapital. Iden suke kama jos platu ya kari. The care kayao kageni mutum. Eche maka shida mpulatu. Kumas tunde sumpara. Mba kayu wene abobani. Dole nesu suchiga ba. Dole nesu achieving em nasu. Dole. Babu nde ze ze hanasu. Sobo de yenzu shugo bankasa. Na Nigeria. Badan Nigeria bani. Jubri el Sudani ne. Tos chine. Ze temokosu su shigo. Ya zaka gia mongwe, hesmen suna chikin koye, gunmen suna chikin koye, suna kanshe, citizen na Nigeria. Kuma sojo jimmu, barasu iya ba, sujesu temoko motani. Ama zaka gen sojo jimmu, suna yao, ahanya banza. Sata suke yi, weni loko chima, du moton de fito, zasu siya mwanang moto, su karabwa kwa hundred naira, kwa fifty naira. Mbaka basu baza harbeka, aikin soja kena. Ama ga, ga hesmen, ga gunmen, a chicken koe. Suna kashi aselen citizen. Wana bung ze gya maka. We akwe wene abone. Wene abone, akwe wene abakboe. Kuma ba asoka geni. Kuma loko chinde idon ka ze bude. Mbaka edade abonde moke padaye nzu. Loko chinde idon ka ze bude. Loko chinde ane gan kama ka. Ane gan chinye ka. Ane gan gama deke. Kuma ba abonde zaka yi. To meze ka yi. Meze ka yi. Bavo. So, but I can come back. I can come back. Ga sojo ju kwe ina. A chikin giri. Su shigo su yi ya king. A kama wan nang motane. A a. Kwa na kimbaya munji. Gowono na data state. Muka karanta. Kwa vangad ne kwa ponch. Ya che we sojo ju. Su ne su ke tamoko. Hes men. Pula nin hes men. Suna kashi wa mushi. Yang kasane. Yang indigenashi. 
ya uwan shi suna kashewa abokina baka gane abun da yake faruba har yanzu baka gane governor ne yayi wannan magana ba wai ni ne ka ce wai propaganda ne wai ba su sa abun da suna governor ne yayi wannan magana shakara wanda ya wuce tiy dan juma wanda kowa ya sani tiy dan juma ne yayi magana we sojoji hanun sojoji yana cikin kashe kashen hanun sojoji yana ciki shi yasa yanzu mu ba mu yi dadin wannan reformation wanda suke kawo ana reforming wani mutum ka ce boko haram terrorist a duniya ba inda ana so terrorist idan ke terrorist ne dole ne kafin a yi magana reformation kai zaka wuce wani process zaka wuce wani process dai wa kafin a ce an reforming dinka a a wannan game ne suke suke yi a kama boko haram a zo a sa shi cikin soja a sa shi rigan soja ba shi bundiga shine zai je tamako dan wan shi fulani wanda ya shiga daga futajelon wanda ya shiga da bokina faso wanda ya zo daga mali wanda ya zo daga nijal shine zai tamako shi e nuna mushi hanya da lungu inda kake daga arewa zuwa kudu e nuna musu kuma su zo su kashe ka da dere ko da rana ka kriya yan sanda bara su zo ba ka kriya sojoji bara su zo ba zaka gani wawan su sojoji suna ci a hanya suna doko 100 naira 50 naira in baka ba su kuma za har baka wannan abun baraka jira abun da ya san muna yin wannan magana saboda muna tosewa muna tosewa yan talaka wannan jeriya saboda su ne masu shan wayan su ne masu shan wayan kowani lokaci amma idan za ku tashi kowai tashi baka yi dade gwamnatin ba baka yi dade kasan ba most especially a ce araba kasan araba saboda idan araba kasan governor naku zai iya samu power da zai yi wani abu kaman lokacin da aka yi kashe kashe a Benue ana yi ma governor na Benue uh, uh, magana interview ana yi mushi magana interview ya ce ba shi da power abin da zai yi saboda ba state police ba state police ba state security do security din ne suke zuwa suna zuwa daga federal kuma federal din ne ike organizing committee coming da ike faru shi yasa kai wanda kana jin magana na aboki na wanda yake jin magana na karka karka patare akan ni karka ce wesh wannan ne yana maganar shi ban za ne baya fada abun da nike so nje kaza kaza a a ka gane abun da muke so ka gane domin mu cire wannan ban zan mutane wanda sun riga sun shigo a cikin mu suna government yanzu suna military suna sojoji suna yan sandawa suna koyina idan ba mu tashi yanzu ba ban san abun da zai faru gobe kuma kuka ina yi ma motani amma yanzu akwai lokacin tashiwa kar ka yi dade komai kar ka yi dade kowa to zan mu doka wannan karanta wanda wani yake kire a mun tell us your name and where you are calling from ka fada sunan ka da inda ka ka kire hello okay ni ni ne alaji umaru na alaji alaji shehu na sokoto alaji umaru shehu daga sokoto na na alaji shehu sokoto na sokoto sanin da zuwa sanin da zuwa ina kwana yawa la ta lo wannan wannan radio brafa dan hausa ne ko eh wannan radio biafra na hausa service domin mu kara mu mu ke magana akan yanwan mu na Hausa mu dukan mu bakin fata ne bai kamata mu cewe mu kaza kaza inda ido mu ya bude a kudu ya kamata ido yanwan mu kuma a arewa ya bude shi yasa muke mu gidan mu ma zin nan dikana ya ce to mu bude wannan domin mu shi gaba da magana su kuma su gane abun da su ci dadi abun da mu muke ci ka ci gaba abokina 
saboda abin da sun amsa kallo ke magana gaskiya tabbas ne suka magana suka magana shi gaskiya ne babu wani kariya babu wani kariya a cikin maganar ta shi wani shi 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 wani da aka ce ma buhari gaskiya ba buhari ba kuma a cikin addinin mutulanci ne cikin 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 addinin mutulanci ne kun mutun ya mutu ta addinin shi rana kuma amma kun ga da yanzu kula ne sun daga sun kan da koni sun ba so kashe duka mutane na Nigeria an yi yan Nigeria sun nan gaskiya mutane mu su bude ido su bude ido saboda ga ya kula ne suna so su kin da komi da komi kore ko mutane mu da Allah da annabi don dar don dar haki kuda kidan ku sosai kore ko ku ta hannu cikin biyafura a ta hannu a tabbuke mutane biyafura kuma mu tabbuke kanmu mu ci gaba da mutane ITOD cikin su akwai gaskiya kuma in ka ce ba gaskiya ba to wata ra kuma ka gani kana cikin gidanka kuma wani dabba zo yanke maka kai Buhari mutane mu gaskiya mun sani an daudu ne dan ruwa'i ne kaji shi yasa abin da ka faru a yanzu ka ga ni ana ka kashe mutane a banza kawai kuma wanda ke magana a radio duk abin da yake fada gaskiya shi ya ga fada muna cewa ku ba wai cikin addini ake wannan musulmi ne ko wannan krista ne amma gaskiya shi a gaskiya ga kula ne suna so su jiye komi da komi amma na san Allah ba zai yadda ba Allah ba zai yadda ba insha Allah Allah ba zai yadda ba na gode ma kamar abbaka daga soko na gode ma daga yau zai mu dinga kira zai mu dinga yi ma mutanen mu magana su tun gabar abin ICOD ke saka shi a gaskiya salamu alaikum alaikum salam alaikum salam na gode ma kamar lan na gode ma kamar lan abaka daga sokoto ka 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 yi kokari an ji ma an ji ma ku dinga a kira min a kira lamba na kun aika lamba na akwai magana da nan na so su fada amma ba cikin jawaba ba salamu alaikum alaikum salam to abin da za yi idan mu idan muka gama za ka kira mu ba mu kira maka ba ka kira mana zan doko zan doko lamban saboda akwai abubuwa hannun mu da yawa mm na amma na gode maka na gode maka ka taimaka mun ka giya kowa saboda mu mun bude mun bude ko wannan su ba su sani ba wai muna kan we wannan radio ya ni ga bude shi ka taimaka ka giya mota ne domin su kariya saboda nan ne idan kowa zai bude anan ne idan kowa zai bude gaskiya mun zo da shi ba wani abu ba ne ba wai ba ma son juna ko kaza kaza ne ko muna akan ba so addinin ka ko waye ne no muna so mu muna so mu tolo a ceiling masun me me zampa wani sunane zan kira musu wannan mota ne wanda suke lala ta kasan kana muna so mu tolo 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 asilin su daya daya ne saboda suke sa mota nin asalin Nigeria suna cin suna shan waya suna shan waya kuma fulani ne suke sa hani akan wannan bin fulani ne shi yasa ba ruwan su ko kasan yana cin gaba ne ko ba cin gaba ba ruwan su saboda abun da suke so su kama kasan su, su kama kasan tukuna idan suke kama su gama da mutanen ayan kasan asalin kasan domin su jin abun da suna so su yi duba ka ce kana da kana da a a a a, a me sunan shi kana da shugoban kasa ga abun da yake faru ba ruwan sa kowa yana magana 
a, a security 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 si barunji wana zenu na maka weshi basalen nigeria bani wana bam dan nigeria ba wana foreigner ni jubri else dan ni bawe muna pada wana bu mo pata ren weni ni a a ama iden ren ka na pata ba ka de gaskia gaskia babo azuchenka ama kuma dole mo pada tun de gaskia ni ko ina ike se mo pada gaskia to shi asa muna o kan wana na gode maka sose na gode maka malam abubaka na sokoto berum sake pada wana namba ze mu je mu sharuwa mu sharuwa do mu mu dawo kuma na kan jira jira malam isa da malam shetima da malam yakubu do mu sushi go na gani akwe wene su da muwa akan hanyan su ama idan ba su zo yo gobe za su zo sobode ishe allah ko wani lokoci za mu dinga zuwa mu zo mu yi magana Lamba ndezeka samemu a a a ausa plus daya bokwe daya takwas uku dua shida uku bokwe uku hudu tara tara verensa kefada daya takwas uku Biu, Shida, Uku, Bokwe, Uku, Hudu, Tara, Tara. Verem pada aturenchi. Plus 183-263-73499. Again, plus 183-263-73499. Bere mu jemu sharuwa mu dawo se mu geni ko hanyan malan isa da malan shetima yana nan jama'a salam alaikum to jama'a mun dawo mun dawo mun dawo a mun dawo mun yi kokari domin mu samu malan isa da malan shitima na gani hanyar malan isa ya ya bude tun da hanyar malan isa ya bude zamu zamu shugo da malan isa malan isa ina kwana 
kama akwache makare Nigeria ne akwache makare ko buhari ne ko mene na gani sobo de inde kake magana muri anka ba de de bane <laughs> katika ba mala nisa sora ne mu uh, sora mu akamwa na radio yao kasi ngakiche wui abunde ansa hano ba ikamata ba ache wui a uh, chire mudi bi kuma a uh, akau mudi bi awara dubishi mutun ya ce maka kawo masa mudubi ya duba abinda ya sa hano zuka gin mutun nan kamar maka hori ko wanda bai da hankali to daga wannan gidan radio gidan radio gaskiya yanda muka ba da mutuni bayan ne abinda yake faru ba abinda ya riga ya faru ko abinda ya riga ya faru nan da yake boyewa dole sai mun mun fida da shi a waje mu nuna mutuni cewa gashi wannan abun na wan abubuwa wannan ya faru amma Nigerian Nigerian government sun boye shi bas to kowa da kai ne to shine abun da ya samu ka ce wai mun fada gaskiya dole mu sun ce zan mutu wa amma ban fada gaskiya ba dole kowa zai mutu to shine abun da ya sa garan mu fada gaskiya nan kowa ya mutu da ina don wannan abun da muke zaman na Nigeria wannan lai ta lai ba zaman mai kyau ba ba zaman rashin lahiya ba zaman kashe mutane da ciwar mutane mu wanda mun akan kasa wannan najeriya wallahi mun gaji daga kasar gidan nan ko da yardo daga rana ko daga minti ko daga awan nan zai kasi cewa mutane sun mutu ba wai daga ba su mutu a daya daya ba amma daga cikin dili dili kuma wasu daga cikin dubu dubu to mai ne ai laifin mutane ai lebi mutuni wai lebin sa buhari shegin buhari na amulki ko lehin mu wai mun dan musu ginde wai su shiga amulkin nan to mai ne lehin mu yanda amma da kasan nan a talakawa ga su ga ko ina ko ko ne bangara ko ne a kasan da ka shiga akan najeriyan nan babu abinci babu kodi babu aiki babu zaman lafiya babu wuta babu likita babu komai da komai kuma ga mu an yi magana za a kashe mu a wuyi haka nan sai a kashe to ai tambaya na ai meni ai laifin na mu laifin mu wai mun dole muku ginde kun shiga amulki to kun shiga amulkin nan ku kice mu wai zaku zaku bada ko komai abu zama a sauki to gashi yanzu wa abin da ya zama sauki buhun na buhun shinkafa na wani ya kasa da shi da to ko inan da kage yanzu ga almajiri ko ina kuma da kanku wanda kuna mulkin nan kuna jin dadi ya abin da kuma da mun kuma da mun kamar shanu ko shanu ma ya hin mu kyau akan wannan kasa to shine abin da ya sa na ce wai jama'a ya kamata da kowa da kowa ya bude idin shi kuma ya fadi gaskiya wasu nan wanda suka ce wai ai sai baba wallahi talai ai ku shige mutane ka ce wai sai baba kana jin yuwa ka ce ne sai baba ba kada sana'a ana ce sai baba kuma ba kada hankali kana ce sai baban nan baka da gidan dakin dakin mai kyau wanda suka aka shiga kuma ka tsaro waka ka aje kwano ka ce wai sai baba ga bin naka ba baka da abun ki mai kyau ba baka da to me yasa mene abubban dadin ka wanda ya dume da kai in ka in ka in ka tuna wannan wannan sana'a na najeriya nan zai fara baka da abun dadi ko abun dariya fara ce wai sai 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 buhari wallahi tallahi wanda ya fara shi sai cire wannan akan ai kai mai sifa ne wallahi kuma ya kamata dai a duba hankalinka ko a kai ka alkita a duba hankalinka da kyau don kana da wani masala wanda 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 yake cin ka a ciki to yanzu shin abun da ni da kai na ga yan fadi yanzu wallahi din ka gani yanda na shiga wannan sudu wala ban bana jin dade don magana ba abun da mu ke abun nan ba abun da mu mun tuna kafin mu sa muku abun nan gende ku shiga bane aka ce burkin nan ba babu ne muke samu ba wallahi ka san ya kamata dai mu ga mu gaskiya mutum mutum wanda yana da hankali kafin ya shigo wani aka ce a kasuwa dole sai ya yi a rubutu ya rubuta abun da yake abun da yake nema a shiga kasuwa nan to ka shiga a kasuwa duk abun da ka rubuta babu da ka gani kuma mutunin su sai suwa su shiga customomi do Allah ka zo ka siya ba zai ka siya abun da baka baka rubuta ba don baka sun shi shine a shine abun da yake fara akan akan wannan Najeriya ga la bare ayi wannan harka da ayi wannan hali da kashikashin nan da babbulata suna koyina 
ya kamata dai a dala wannan kasa wallahi ko waya shigo dun mai da aka ce baban namu malam buba galadima da tiwa dan juma dukan su sun fadi gaskiya ya kamata dai a dala wannan kasan nan kowa ya shiga malam isa barin tambaye ka barin dan bakika dan kaida araba nan araba kasan kaida to ke da kanka kana jin dadi a gunda kake ko ni bana cin ko goyo rana sai kashi mutane bana cin dadi meni meni ai lifin ka mutane da da ka kashawa manyoyi nan dukin su yaron su da diyan su da 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 warkotan nan su duka suna a can kasan waje to ga mu an kana kashi mu dun lefi lefi mu dun mun dole musu gindi su shigo a mulki ne ko ku akuma ne ba abinci suke ba mu ba ba salama suke mun ba ba hanyar mai cha suke ba mu ba babu wuta ga zafi ko ina ba mu da ko aikin mai kyau to wasu gunan nan da muke yi sai sun kawo shanu shanu nan na ya ba ba ta ko mu da ko kai magana sai ja ce ma a goyi a goyi a shine a goyi wannan ko kuma don ka cewa cewa ai dan wannan su yana mulki mutane ba hulata to wallahi tallahi mun gaji da wannan harka wallahi gaskiya gaskiya mun gaji da shi gara dala wannan kasa to yanzu zai ka giya ina yeah. son tambaye kamar lan yi san mutum zai shiya waye shiga gona e yi aiki aikin gona kasan kasan iri wayan da aka shiya akan wannan aiki saboda na sin ka ke ke sarkin gona ne lokacin to ka gama aikin wani mutum ne e shigo da shanu e zai lalata maka kuma kuma kana kan magana kana kan complain a zuwa kashe ka akan wannan abun idan kana da shugoban kasa idan shugoban wanda yace shugoban kasa wanda yace shi shugoban kasa idan shi asalin Nigeria zai dade irin wannan abun da ina so in tambaye kamar lan isa to uh, uh, malam obilo gaskiya gaskiya ga yayi komi don gama gaskiya don ka wannan kasan nan kowa da kowa ya ji cewa ai na ba fulata ne inda ba na ba fulata ba ya to mai asa suke ce mun wai ai su ba fulata nan ai su ba ko to daga bakon nan kuma cikin national assembly suke ce wai za a ba su rehabilitation kuma a jina musu gida a mai da shi daga bugo boko haram da beti Allah a sa su a cikin sojojin na Nigeria to sa wan shi cikin sojojin na Nigeria ai sai da abun da zai zai yi din ne problem na Nigeria ne to wanda suna a cikin sojoji yanzu shakaran su nawa ne suke faka wajen training to waje wasu shakaran biyu shakaran biyar shakaran goma kafin su sa kaki a ba su makamai su fara zuma soja na najeriya to ga su wannan sati daya sati biyu ko kwana biyar za a sa su to a ba su kaki a ba su makamai to mai ne anubin ka ai dukan su terrorist dukin terrorist nan dun ba su da wani abu ba su da abun da abun da abun da zai su in ba dai su kashe mutune don su mai da mutune nan kowa ya zuma wara jin tsoro su kowa don kasancewa in ka an fata maka abun gonan naka in ka yi magana sai a kashin ka sai to shine abun da sun san sun abun da sun san jawa za su ya su sun abun da sun gan dama akan wannan mulki don in ba mulki wannan in ba mulki ba fulaka ba mai asa burtai ba iso ka ba bi sunko daga daga aiki su dun mutun sun ce sun sun cewa aiki burtai ya 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 yi abu nan ya ya kar ya kar ne kina to mai asa an burshi a can mai asa dai aka burshi in ba dai na nufi akwai wani abu abu ba mana kyau akwai wani abu da suke nufi shine abu da asa aka burshi can burtai daga burunu ai shi bane aka ce daga burunu state to ga gidan shi ma ba ya aishi gidan shi saboda boko haram to shi da kanshi ba yi da wani iri ne ba yi da wani karfi ba yi da wani harka da abun da zai iya yi ya san cewa zai iya yi ya dinna ka cika shin nan don shi da kanshi yana goyon bayan boko haram yana goyon bayan miyati Allah yana goyon bayan henchmen in da dalolin sunan wanda suna a cikin najira wanda suka kace mun da ai shi burtai ya san su dukan su shin abun da ya sa bo har da kanshi ba ya sukar da shi bala masu mutun su ce cin cewa aikin shi nan na kasa ya 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 spy ya kar kina to in ji da abun da ya sana gama wallahi idan haka nan so kashi mutane kan banza banza 
mutun taraka wa so kashi saka kan bazan wasa ya kamata da addara wannan kasa ko wa yi shigo a bannan nashi don mu samu rashin lafiya ba da babun wannan muyi negotiation ba inda abun da muke yi negotiate ba to me yasa dai ba yi abun da ya kamata maganan ka raba kenan ai raba kenan malan isa maganan ka raba kasan kawai kawai je huta shi na abun da ya na fadi wallahi to na gode na gode malan isa malan isa kafin ka tufi ina so wani shaura ne zaka ba sojoji Nigeria kwe asalin dan kasan sojoji a Nigeria yanzu wanda ba su gane abun da yake faru yanzu ana ta shigo musu ana ta shigo musu da Boko Haram wanda ya ka ce we sun tuba ne ko sun ce reforma sun reformin din su ko sun repent ne ko me ko kaza ne ana ta tura musu ciki kuma asalin a um sojojin Nigeria mai kriki za a doko su a ji a zuba su a Zambiza forest ana ta kashewa a suna ana tan kashe su da 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 Boko Haram Boko Haram zai kashe su saboda za ka su wajen zai ka gani wannan su photo da wannan su video a Facebook ba ruwan share ba makamin yakin abun amma zai ka gani Boko Haram suna da asalin makamin yaki meni shaura ne zai ka gina musu mintu biyu ko uku kafin ka tufi a malan isa Oh bando ni magana kasun wa bunda ka ka gande ga idon ka bai kamata baka bari abun nan jaki ya ya kashe maka in ka gan shi kasan cewa wani abun yake zuwa to sojoji na Nigeria na wani sunyi saura suna bunda zaka to wani soja yanda zaka ga maka ba da bayane wani sunyi saura nan a cikin gudana wani suke wanda bukwaran ya kashe ya ci wursu Nigerian government bai magana nan shi ba to ai su wanda sun yi sauran ai manyoyi men da kace commandant da 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 GSM da 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 RSM ko GOC ko abun nan ai su ne wanda suna a shiga wanda suna a cikin barak ai su waye ne su ba hulata to sojoji wanda suna aiki wanda suna a cikin wanda suna a sambisa wanda suna a jejin nan ai talakawan sojoji nan to dukan su an kashe su dun nayi wannan magana wallahi talai ba zasu ya su ji ba dun sun lasun mutu da kina wanda suna a cikin najiran soja yanzu wanda suna a cikin aikin na najiran yanzu ai dukan su wanda suna da niyya an kashe mutane ko kowa to in kai wannan magana ka ce musu a ka su danna ko su su sauko daga daga sojoji su gudu ko su ke wai a ba su ya ba kasan ana ba su kudi ko da yoci an ka ce wai ana ba su dubu dubu uku dola kasan dola dubu uku ne aka ba su ko ne rana to ya zai ya ce musu su danne ai su ba hulata to shabun ne nake fadi akan najeriya wannan wallahi tallahi in ba din in ba dai hukunci na 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 ba hulata ba to me yasa inda suke ce sun cewa wannan harkan da hali da bukwaran da abin da yake fadi ka shin nan sojoji sojoji na najeriya inda sun shi cewa kafin su bi maka ba mai asaba su bir kasan tarawa ko amerika ko wasu afrika su shigo so ta muke su so danne harkan nan za su ce musu a a ba su so su shigo ba su su ta muke su to dun kasan cewa government ai shine ai boko haram shine abun da yasa yana kashe kashin sojan nan ba ka gin shi a television ba ka gin shi wanda aka rubuta mustafa to yanzu wanda ai sun saura ko na gan sai cewa bota ya ce wai suna so su recruit yutsu sa a cikin soja kuma yanzu ba sun bar cewa police sai su yakin mai nakaci Boko Haram yanzu a yi recruit youth to a yi recruit youth wannan kuma a fara kashe su na ga muku gaskiya gaskiya wallahi talai in Nigeria tai soho Nigeria ya lalace Nigeria ya lokacin darin kasan nan wallahi ya ma wuce ya kamata dai mu ga kan mu gaskiya gaskiya ika wannan kasa a dare shi ko sojojin nan ko abun nan ko ne wanda su na amma wannan su sauraron su na ma cikin soja in kan in kana so lafiya kana so zaman lafiya wallahi talai ka koma a gidan ka bai ta daga cikin soja soja wannan sojan banza wanda za a baka makamin soho makamin 1979 lokacin shehu shigar kuma a ba su wayannan mai ne kace Boko Haram makami na 2020 kuma a cikin maka ka jire ka ka ayi kokuwa da su ayi kokuwan banzan ne sai da kashin kaza ayi 
ba kana gane abin da yanda aka kai yanka ku sai aka nan da aka aka shi warku aka aka doka abin lafiyar naku ne kuma ba wanda yake makana hor suja to kai wallahi tallahi wannan abun ba abun mamaki ne to malan nan zan yan sai zan ce maka assalamu alaikum jama'a wanda ya sauraron mu yo zan koma a cikin studio nan wani lokaci na gode maka na gode maka malan isa na gode maka sosai shi yasa ne na son ka sosai don wani lokaci ka shigo domin mu yi magana domin mu yi wannan abin da Allah ya kriya mu mu yi mu giya mutane abin da ike faru na gode maka sosai saboda don maganan dai kake fada ai gaskiya ne ai sul ne in ka fada ai wanda zai ji ya ji wanda zai ji ya ji ya kamata a raba Najeriya Najeriya ya riga ya sufa Najeriya bari iya tamake ka a raba kasan kowa ya ji a bakin malan Isa Najeriya bari iya tamake ka ba a Bokina Najeriya bari iya tamake ka dan wana Najeriya bari iya tamake ka duk abin da zaka samu a Najeriya sai kashi kashi sai mutuwa kawai abun da zaka iya samu a kasan kashewa kashewa kawai to ke sojoji ke soja ji bayani na wannan bayani ina giya maka ina ba da sojojin Najeriya asalin sojoji mai farin ciki sojoji wanda suna so kasan amma ba su gane abun da yake faru ba kar ka je wajen ka kashi kanka banza kar ka je wajen ka kashi kanka banza duba abun da yake faru yanzu Asalin Boko Haram za su bar musu a cikin gari suna kan sata suna kan sata mutane su siya ko wani luxury ko motane ko keke na fefe ko kaza kaza suna kan karban kudi a gun su amma akwai asalin yaki a cikin a cikin jeji bara su bara su ke wannan mutane a wajen za su ke ka za su ke su za su bar su a cikin gari amma ke ne asalin nan jiya za su ke ka a a zambiza ka je wajen ka mutu a banza saboda akwai abun da suke shirye akwai shirye shirin da suke boye ba sa so ka gane ba sa so ka gane saboda suna so su rage asalin dan kasan najeriya domin fulani su 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 kama kasan gaba daya domin fulani su kama kasan gaba daya wannan ne nufin su wannan ne abun da yake zuciyar su to kai idan kai kana cikin soja kuma baka gane ba ina son bude idon ka domin idon ke bude yanzu sai ka gin sai ka gane abin da zaka yi ni baran giya maka abin da zaka yi saboda idan ka san gaskiya ka riga ka san abin da zaka yi ko sai ka ci gaba da shi da duhu aikin ka ne ko kuma zaka tuba aikin ka ne baro wannan amma ka tabbatar abin da yake faru go hono na delta state ne yayi magana kwa nakin baya ya ce we sojoji suna tamako hesmen su kashe mushi yan kasan shi kai asalin soja na nigeria ke soja dan kasa na san baraka yi irin wannan ban wannan bin baraka yi ba saboda lokacin training din ka aka baka training kai ka defending ka defending the territory na kasan dai ka defendin mutane kuma muna kalo a tv muna gani sojojin na america na china na italy na kaza kaza abun da suke yi ko a ce akwai kaman iro natural disaster din earthquake ko kaza kaza saka gani su za su fito su temoko mutanen su amma a nigeria ana gani wani abu daban sojo soja za su tamako masu kashe mutane yan kasa suna ci uburo uban su wannan mutum wannan wanda ka gani ai ba asalin soja ba ne wannan reform boko haram wanda suka sa cikin soja wannan fulani ne suka kawo a cikin shi yasa suka yi wannan aiki kuma kai soja ne saboda irin training da aka baka baraka iya gane ba baraka iya gane ba amma wannan radio biafra na house service wanda mai gidan mu mazi inan da kano ya bude da almajirinsa mu fito mu fada gaskiya 
yana ge maka yanzu idan idon ka zai bude zan zaka ida idan daka cire bekin ciki wanda sun riga sun sa maka wanda sun riga sun sa maka idan zaka cire shi ka gane asalin gaskiya da muke fada zaka ci dadi gobe zaka ci dadi gobe zaka gane saboda so, kasan Nigeria ba abun da aka giya maka ana yi Nigeria ya riga ya mutu akwai wani abu dabam ne akwai wani abu dabam ne to yanzu zamu para um, a shigo na uh, in, na turinci english version zamu yi summary abun da muke fada a uh, turinci zamu fada saboda yan wanku yan mamu wanda ba sa jin Hausa amma sun bude radio suna so su gane abun da muke fada zamu yi musu summary aminti kaza 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 kuma mu jiran su inda akwai wanda yana so ya kiriya mu zai iya kiriya yi maganar sa amma kuma idan kana shigo yanzu kuma kana so ka kiriya kan Hausa zamu doka call dinka ba damuwa amma zamu switching off to english uh, version na geshe ku na geshe ku na ce Allah ya tamake mu salam alaikum
Good morning, good afternoon, uh, good evening, wherever you are. This is Radio Biafra House Service to under the platform of Radio Biafra London. Heavily deputized by the good man himself, Mazi Uchemefo, and under the leadership of one and only our great leader, Mazi Namdekano. Ohamadi Kewan of Biafra Land. He is the director of Radio Biafra and her television. A man who remained incorruptible from day one. A man who they have tried by all means to bring him down. But indeed, the hand of God is still showing that I am the one who sent him and I will be with him. Under his command, we are coming to do this work. And I still remain the humble servant of Jehovah and also a humble servant of IPOB worldwide in the name of Mwachineke. We are here to bring message to you. We are here to speak to our Hausa brothers. When we say Hausa brothers, we are Africans, irrespective of our tribe or whatever. We are here to bring the good news, the truth. We are here to bring out the truth to you to understand what is happening in the zoo. Because the zoo has used propaganda to, to destroy the, the entire black race and the entire country. So we are here to tell you the truth and nothing but the truth. So that is why we always start with Hausa language. And we will bring the summary in English for you to understand why we are here. Our leader had been broadcasting since 2013, opening the eyes of people all over the world in this awakening time. But some people still don't understand. But based on what is happening now, I believe that some are understanding. So we, the children of Mazin Namdekano, we are here also to help in propagating this gospel, to reach to our fellow Africans, other indigenous tribe in Nigeria for them to understand what is going on, how they are being cheated, how they are being sold into slavery, even in this modern time. What is really happening? We are here to speak the truth and nothing but the truth. If the truth pains you, that's proof that you are not a good person. You need to repent, you need to change. But if you are a good man seeking for truth, but ignorantly you fall out, when you hear the truth, it won't pain you much. It won't be so bitter. You will accept it and make a U-turn and begin to move. So we are here. This is Radio Biafra, Hausa Service 2. In summary of what we have said in Hausa, we are talking, exposing the lies of Nigeria, the lies of the government for a long time. What the Fulanese has been doing, the plan of the Fulanese since 1804, when they came in, via Otman Damfodio, they were accepted into the country, Nigeria, by the uh, king of Hausa in Sokoto that time. It is called Gori, not Sokoto then. Hausa people are very good people. Hausa people are passionate people. Also, people are accepting people. They are very good people, moving people. They will like you. They will welcome you, give you whatever you want. We are saying this thing for you, our Hausa brothers, to know that indeed we are not against you. But the thing is that your mind had been polluted over us and you people will see us as your enemy. But if you neutralize your mind and stand on the neutral ground, when you see the truth, you will know that indeed this is the truth. That this IPOB leader, Mazin Namdekano, and his boys, his people, are speaking the truth. Indeed, you will accept it. Hausa people are very good people. They were there. They saw this man. He came with all manner of lies and whatever and a lot of things from nowhere, from Futajelon. He walks into Nigeria. He walks into that territory and he was welcomed. Four years later, he was staying there. He killed the king of that area and he took over. From there, what we call jihadists in Nigeria kick off. And they begin to advance. That is how they escalated. Each place they conquer, each place the Fulani conquered, 
they will put an emir there. That is why we are seeing emir in various places, in various places in the north. Emir is not indigenous to Aousa. Aousa, real Aousa, Nigeria, I don't know what emir is. It's just like coming in eastern region, in Biafra land, and you are talking of emir, just like the stupid one they did a few days ago by the useless governor who forced himself into the, in, into the seat of power. There is nothing like emir in eastern region. We know what our own traditional ruler answered, the same way it is in the north. But as a result of con conquest by the uh, Fulanese, as a result of the jihadists, wherever they capture, whoever is the general that, you know, lead in that war, they make him emir and he'll stay there. They fought this, conquered the entire north and still moving down to, to, to the middle belt. Meeting all manner of tribes, the indigenous tribe of the country, meeting them one after the other and the dealing with them. Desecrating their land, removing some of their sacred things, the way of their worship and whatever, they were conquered and removed and forced you into what they brought. You may be part of what they are worshiping to do or whatever. That is not my business. But the thing is that you shouldn't have, they shouldn't have forced you in. Even if you believe in what they believe, they should not change your ancestral uh, 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 name. They should not change your ancestral behavior. They should not change your tradition. They shouldn't change your culture. That is what tells who you are all over the world. Your culture speaks for you. But this is what the Fulani we are doing. That is why when you come to the north today, you won't be able to differentiate who is a Hausa man and who is a Fulani man. But there they know, but some of the Hausas, based on the good heart they have, they are unable to dictate this thing, even till today. Some of them don't know because they are using religion to influence them, to cover their eyes. You think that they are practicing the religion or they are playing religious game. No. They are playing a very dangerous political game, capturing every play, everywhere. Today, you find it very difficult to find who is Hausa man and who is a Fulani man in Nigeria. Very difficult for you to know or accept some of them. You would have asked yourself, why are they killing themselves in the north? Why are they killing people in Zamfara and whatever? These people are trying to eliminate, to reduce the number of the indigenous Hausa people in that area. These are their plans. They are the same religion, then why are they still fighting? So to tell you that indeed they have a very dangerous agenda, secret agenda which you don't know, and this is the duty of the Fulani. And they have been doing, they have been doing it and they are still doing it. Some part of the north and some part of the middle belt have been conquered. I'm quite sure that those areas, they killed people in southern Kaduna today. If you go there and tell somebody that such indigenous people we are living in this area, so, so, so time, you won't believe. Because it is full, filled now with Fulanese, with foreigners, with aliens. You don't know where they come from. So these are the things we are speaking. We are trying to help our Hausa brothers. We are not fighting you. We are not your enemy. We, are, we just want to open your eyes. This is 21st century. This is an awakening time, my dear brother. Are you in the middle belt or are you in the corner? Any part, open your eyes, understand the truth, understand what is really happening. The person that will help you to survive is the person that will propagate hate speech, propagate, bring all manner of bad names against that person so that you will not listen and they will be able to conquer you. This thing is still happening. The same way they use, the same tactics they use during the civil war. The Middle Belt claim that they are Christian. They were the one the Fulani used to fight their own people. I was in the north some, time, some years ago and I heard that story that immediately after the war, what, what were they saying? They were telling to the middle belt that time, Arana Yakashi, Arana, who brought this word? Not the Hausa people, but the Fulanese. Arana Yakashi, Arana, Arana Yakashi, Arana. They used them as a tool to achieve their aim. So this is the time you have to wake up. You take the truth and fight the last battle so that you free yourself and free the generation that are coming out of you. Because as for them, they never relent in their conquest. They never relent. 
they will make sure that they achieve their aim. And they have said it that Nigeria is their ancestral home. So you that still remain in the middle bell, within the plateau, stop playing politics. Stop playing Nigerian politics. You must rule and you must not rule. On that process, you go and sign a particular agreement so that you will give a particular land to Fulani and whatever so that they will come in and you will become the governor or a minister whatever. You are selling your soul to the devil. And if you die, your spirit, your soul will never rest in peace because of those kind of things. Just like what the present governor of Imo State is doing now. Such a man, when he dies, his soul will never rest in peace. For you to sell entire race, entire generation to an alien. But to you, my dear brothers within the north, you are the one we are speaking to. To understand what our leader, Mazin Namdekano, is telling you. And stop listening to Nigerian media. And stop listening to politicians. What they are saying, telling you is a hate speech. Well, why should we fight you? Why should an Igbo man fight you? For what reason? You are not blocking his way. You have your own territory. We have our own territory. But an alien, a virus has came in to, to spoil the entire system. Telling you all manner of things. And now they are using you. You can't. They, it is happening now. But some people cannot see it. You cannot differentiate an Awosa man and the Fulani man. Except they themselves. Even some of the houses don't know who they are. So these are the things we are here to bring, to speak, to let the world know. Not the world, but let you in that north know. And also to our brothers in the middle belt, those who are still foolish, when they tell you about uh, uh, the issue of Nigeria, IPOB, Biafra, whatever, you think about Biafra war and all the nonsense uh, um, General Gowon and his cohort as a den, you know, injected into the brain of your ancestors and they pass it down to you and you are still believing in those nonsense. That is why we are here to bring all those things to, 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 uh, to clean your brain, to format your mind once again, to reset your brain. So that you understand the danger. The Fulani has already surrounded almost the entire nook and cranny of Nigeria. They are into military. They are into police. They are into all the forces. That is why we are speaking to soldiers as well. For them to understand the danger ahead. You take a real indigenous people of Nigeria who are part of the military, you take them to the Zambiza forest, to the to where the Boko Haram are. You did not give them food. You did not give them enough sophisticated weapon to fight the enemy. You just leave them there. Within a twinkle of an eye, all of them will be wiped off by Boko Haram. Then you now catch some of the Boko Haram reformed. You give them the soldier uniform. You bring them inside the town. They are robbing people with their gun, collecting money. 100 naira, 50 naira. If you don't pay, they shoot you just like that. And some of them are accomplishing the mission, helping the herdsmen, helping the Fulanese, helping the gunmen, whatever name the press gave them, helping them to kill people, to conquer. We are speaking this thing for some of the soldiers to understand what is going on so that you won't die unless you, you, you won't just die in vain so that we can wake up at this time to save our life one thing you must know is that nigeria has expired it can never be good if you continue to play, play the role of one nigerian definitely you are preparing your death not just for you to die, but your entire, entire generation. Your race will be wiped off. Because there are some certain little clans and tribes in the north that are no more existing. Fulani eat them up as at the time they conquer. There are some certain people. They are no more into existence. Or they have been mixed with other race, other tribe there. And they are no more. So that is why we are telling you this. You don't need to keep on supporting all this useless one Nigeria of a thing. Your duty is to wake up to follow the truth. IPOB under the leadership of Mazin Namdekano is telling you the truth. Yes, we stand for the restoration of Biafra. 
but that thing is to give you the truth. That thing is to help you. The essence of bringing Biafra up is to help you. There is something in Biafran flag which most of us don't know. Our leader gave this lecture years ago, as of 2013. The, the meaning of that song on this black stripe of Biafran flag. That it will bring, Biafra is that song. It will bring light into the dark continent of Africa. And it has started within the eastern region. Nobody, I don't think there is any mugu within the eastern region now. The eyes of the west have opened. For Yoruba to agree and form a Amoteku, this is an idea that came from our leader, Mazin Namdekan, years back. But because of the Sabo leaders, the political allies we have within our area could not give the support. It's still in limbo. But you see how the Yorubas pick it up. The Western, they pick it up and they have established it. That is the duty of Biafra being uh, uh, um, propagated by our leader, Mazin Namdekano, under the platform of IPOB. That light will come into the darkest continent of Africa. So that is why we are giving you this word. How will that light shine? How will that sun shine? It will come as a result of giving you all these words. Telling you, opening your eyes to understand. It's quite obvious that Buhari is dead. For a long time it had been given many evidence. A lot of pictures. Uh, posting it on social media. Telling you all manner of things. Even the wife of Buhari came and said all manner of, make all manner of statements. The other day it was Abakiari and the other man exchanging words. They don't know whose uh, um, command they will take. Whereby you have a head of state. In which place you see the head of state and you see the uh, army staff or chief, uh, defense minister following him up and down. Because he is the remote telling him what to do. These things will tell you that indeed the Buhari is telling you the truth. But our problem is that we don't want to accept the truth. This is one of our problems. But we, the children of our leader, Mazin Namdekan, will continue to give you this lecture. We are the light. We are the children of light. And wherever light comes, there will be, the darkness will disappear. We will continue to give so that you will understand to save yourself from this danger that is coming. So we are speaking to everyone to understand. We are telling people to know why we are doing all these things. We don't help you. But if you hate us, we know that you are an evil person. Anybody who don't want Biafra, anybody who don't like what IPOB is doing as at now, is an evil man. Even if he speaks the same language with me, we know that. But anybody who is looking, who is thirsty for truth, for good thing, will embrace Biafra. Why is it that each time you mention the name of Biafra, wouldn't they not, wouldn't the Fulanis and whatever, they are not happy? Because they know that that is the truth. Biafra is the truth. If you divide Nigeria today, now you see progress. You see progress. There will be competition among all the countries that came out of the ashes of the Zoological Republic of Nigeria. And everybody will be competing itself to grow. And you see, we'll be helping each other. But they don't want it. Fulani are wanderers. Parambuletin Maringarin along the desert of Sahara Desert of Africa. They don't want to settle one place. So they just want to come in. And take over some people's ancestral land. Some land you see. People have been dead. People have been indigenous to that land. For years. For thousands of years. And you just want to come from nowhere. To take it up from them. It will not work again. Because this is 21st century. So that is why we are here. To bring this message for you. To know. To understand why we are here. It is not her speech my brother. It is to help you. But anyone that calls it her speech is an evil person because he doesn't like the truth. But as for the truth, we will speak the truth irrespective of whoever you are and whatever is going to cause. The truth must be said. So if you, uh, if you want to contribute, if you want to speak to us, we will give you this number. You call on WhatsApp. WhatsApp only. You will get out on WhatsApp. Plus 183 Two six three seven three four nine nine. I repeat again. Plus one eight three two six three 
seven three four nine nine so you can call our whatsapp line now and make your contribution or if you have a question we will clear you this is radio biafra outer service 2 under the platform of radio biafra london heavily deputized by the good man himself mazuz chemefo and under the leadership of one and only mazin namdekanu ohamadike one of biafra land he is the director of radio biafra and her television and the man elohim has chosen for this job we are his children we are his student and we are following him we have seen the light i will continue to follow i would like you to join to enjoy this light we are enjoying so you can call in now you can call in now if you have any contribution to make or any question to give this is a place where you will get what you want not fabricated stories not fabricated stories <laughs> Okay, call up on the line. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. us your name and where you are calling from tell us your name and where you are calling from hello my name is Onyechi Ibeko I'm calling from Iguacha okay Onyechi from Iguacha all right you are welcome to Radio Biafra House yes. Service too uh you can give your contribution now hello we just lost her now Please call back. Call back. I think it's network. Hey, hey, hey. 
Give us your name and where you are calling from. Your yes, name uh, and my where comrade. You are from. Yes, comrades. Uh, this is uh, Maziane Nene from Texas. Oh, Maziane Nene. <laughs> yes, how sir. You? How are you? Oh, okay. How is everyone? I uh, will give glory to the Most High. He said, I say, I say to that. I say, Amen to that. Exactly. Um. You're highly welcome. Give yes, us your uh, contribution and uh, or any questions. Ab absolutely. <clears throat> absolutely. You know, when you begin to talk about the animal kingdom, it, it, it's really hard to even figure out where to start because it's such a mess. It, it, it's, it's such a hopeless, it's such a useless place that it's, uh, it's, it's, it cannot be anything. There's no other way to really qualify it other than to be a place created for death because it cannot nurture life. The only thing it can contribute to humanity is death because nothing good will ever thrive uh, in that land. Nothing good. You know, there was a question you, you guys uh, posed there last night. Um, someone was asking what will be the why why can one black country at least or, or, of all the black countries on the planet why couldn't one just come up with something good you know and and um, someone tried to answer that question uh, but I, I just want to add to 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 the answer because that the, the answer is the core problem that we have everything Every, all the disastrous things that come out of Nigeria are built around the foundation of Nigeria. And so when you really take that foundation apart, you cannot help but figure out that, hey, nothing good will ever come from Nigeria. Because on everything's foundation lies the good nature of it or the bad nature of it. Whether it can sustain life, whether it can nurture life, whether it's a place where advancement can come from, or whether it's just a place for death and destruction, which is what Nigeria personifies. Now, the answer to that question is the way Nigeria is constituted, in other words, the foundation. Whenever you have people that have absolutely nothing in common and you put them together, the first thing is that it's going to create hate among the people. That's one. Because... Each individual group is diverse. It's, they are different, different entities. I keep telling people, it's like if you throw in Pakistan into the United States and you go ahead and uh, if that's not enough, you throw in uh, Saudi Arabia, 
with their Wahhabi Salafist way of life. You will, you will see United States just degrade and die. But of course, the people that own this country, they wouldn't allow that to happen. Instead, they will fight to death. That's the difference. So in the foundation of Nigeria, it can never, never, it's impossible. And, has, and such has never happened in the history of, of mankind. Nothing like Nigeria has ever sustained life. Nothing like Nigeria has ever accorded humanity a room for advancement. It's always destruction. You see, as, the, as the let, let, me, let, me, let me throw, let me add more distinct question to you. You saw that you answer all. Absolutely. Then why is it? Absolutely. Why is it that up till now, our people have not really understand what is going on? Their eyes have not opened. Even down to the east, look at that of um, Imo State now that is trending. Yes. They still yes. don't understand. What is our problem, my dear brother? Can you help us? Maybe you have Absolutely. the answer. Absolutely. Uh, uh, well, well let, me, let me contribute something to that effect. Here's what I'm... See, if you, on the analysis of things, you know, analytics is not our, our fault. It's, we're not, we don't have strength there. See, what we are suffering now, Mazi, is the symptom of what was left immediately after the Biafra Nigeria war. You see, immediately after the war, everybody went about their business. There was no cohesive element. There was no cohesive entity at all to unite our people and say, no matter what, even though we've lost the war, never forget who we are. Here's our culture. Here's our value system. On that, we, we, we must continue. We had no cohesive force. And remember, the people that would have provided all this, all this that leadership, if you will, we then made sure that they were all killed. Because remember, when they announced that the war had ended, the war didn't really end. Because Britain and one other country, I'm not going to name here, sat together and, and came up with a plan and told Gowon that you now have to go back all those 50, the, the really poor people in Biafra, you must hunt them down and kill all of them. Otherwise, they will come, up, come back and be a thorn on your, on your flesh. And that's exactly what Gowon did. In fact, Omar told was one of them. The war had ended before they killed him. So they hunted down the people that would have actually gone into hiding and continued, the people that understood what we were fighting for, the core people that we had. And so there was no cohesive force that would unite our people, even, you know, having been conquered, to at least continue to endeavor to keep our value system. So it was the, the, uh, the th things fell apart. And so the center couldn't hold. You see, that's what happened. That's why we are... So what we're suffering is the consequences of that, that failure. That not able to continue our way of life. And so everything fell apart. Because if we had continued remembering who we were, then we would have killed all the saboteurs. You see, there's something I learned from history. I'm sure when you look at China, or even the Bolshevik Revolution, you look at the Chinese Revolution, you look at the American Revolution, the French, the rest of them, even England. There's one commonality that you see in all of them. Once, it's always taking the uh, minority, a very few people, and look at mama, very few people to work very, very hard, sacrifice whatever they, 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 they deem sacrificable to achieve greater good for greater number of people. But here's what happens. Here's one thing that is common. And I've studied all of these. Once they achieve their objective, which means independence, then they kill all the saboteurs. Because in reality, you can actually not reconstitute a decent, credible, sustainable society with the saboteurs lingering everywhere. So the only way you can do that is to ensure that they are liquidated. The Chinese uh, one, they put it like uh, uh, let me million. come in. Let me come in a bit. Mm. You are yes. talking about when the freedom has been uh, uh, gotten, Ach achieved, absolutely achieved. Let's say um, 
our late general uh Odumegu Juku of blessed memory we was able to uh you know achieve his mission uh, that is yes. what he would have done because he himself uh, uh knew them as at that time those saboteurs that were in their midst but there is something that is still you know disturbing my understanding this time within us now we have an enemy the same enemy of our ancestors are still there now we are playing That's the correct. roles of saboteurs among ourselves to them but at the end of the day we will they won't pay us for example look at our politician they will serve them after serving them they will still be disgraced Oju Zokal is in prison now Theodoji yes. is at stake what is his name a former pdp chairman meto i heard that they gave him seven years and this yes. uh, buffoon in Imo State now is waking up, warming up to do the same thing. Um, the governor yes. of, uh, 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 what's his name, uh, Abia State, everybody s uh, saw the role he played, even yes. during Python yes. dance yes. and whatever. They are still yes. serving the same them. people that will, at the end of the day, they will still... What is wrong with us, my dear brother? I don't know if you have the answer, and I don't know whether you understand what I'm saying. Because what you're saying is I, I right. Really understand what the you're freedom saying. is being uh, achieved. This is what we will do. But now, both them and their own people that they are suppressing are not free in the hands of the enemy, and still they don't have brain. My dear brother, That's please, me? in two, three minutes, I would just like you to give me something and our listeners as well. What is our problem? Well, our problem is the lack. I mean, we didn't establish that, call it an accord. In other words, we didn't kill the saboteurs. The likes of people that Oduku could get money to come uh, to go outside and get weapons. And they came to the United States, some of them, and settled, bought Volvos and, and were living large. So nobody went after them. And so since we failed to establish that lesson so that it will be an ongoing doctrine that everybody could have understood, that emboldened the class of criminals that we have now. Until we start, let me let, let, let me tell you something. If we had earlier on to assassinated all these hoodlums, let's say that when uh, Article Dunga, uh, you know, came uh, squandering money, coming here to the United States and buying uh, homes, that we killed him. So I bet you that whoever would have replaced him would have thought twice about stealing money. If we had killed him a long time ago, because that, that, that animal deserved to be, to be gone. If we had dealt with him, who, listen, here's the thing. You have to establish some lessons for people to learn. That's one thing that is common among all these people that we say they are civilized people or that they are independent. You know, Africa never really had a revolution. That's the problem. You come to Africa, all you see are countries. There are no nations. And each tribe is pitted against the other one. And the second one is pitted against the third one. The third one is pitted against the, the, the fourth one. And whenever one of them rises up and says, look, since you cannot provide us running water, you cannot provide us security, electricity is like uh, going to the moon on a horseback. Uh, maybe we can do better, you know, by ourselves. Or immediately, they take those imported weapons and finish them off. And of course, the colonial master is never far away. Because all they do is in, in Africa is toy with us. They come here now and, you know, they have business all over, the, all over Africa now. It's Djibouti is like the headquarters. So from there, they run their terrorist networks and then come back and tell you that they are helping you fight them. You see, there's a game that's going on, but, but that's different. So in our case, especially with this uh, useless baboon in, in, in Imo State, we must make sure that guy doesn't, doesn't continue. It's our right, it's within our right that we get him, even tie him in public square and hang him and set him on fire. It's within our right because he's coming to kill, he's already killing us. Every single human being has every right to defend himself. We have that right, but we don't exercise it. You see, because immediately after the war, none of our people has ever done anything. I mean, with, like I said, we don't have that cohesive force. There was nothing holding us together. Every, we scattered everywhere. Okay, we, we were like just, uh, you know, when Omaka uh, uh, germinates, the seeds go everywhere. They fall wherever they may. 
and nobody was around to say, never forget who we are. Even if we are running politics with, the, with, this, with our conquerors, never forget who we are. So our people just started doing all kinds, all manner of things. Then immediately, the criminality became, it was immediately, remember by the Asika? The criminality came immediately, emboldened and supported and financed and, you know, oiled by the, uh, by the, uh, our, con you know, conquerors and their masters, because their masters give, tell them what to do. So be because of lack of that, now, Everybody does whatever he or she wants because they know that there will be no consequences. If we had started earlier on to make sure that, look, there's a cost to betraying our, our tradition. There's a cost to stealing from, from, from our people. There's a, there's a cost. I mean, we impose costs. Let me give you an example, Mazi. This uh, uh, Ebony guy that went uh, to some interview, and had the mendacity to sit there and say that they pretty much, in essence, that they are more interested in following whatever Nigerian constitution is or whatever oath they swore than preserving the lives of his own people. If his house had burnt down by the time he made it to his house, do you think that uh, things will still be the same in a urban state? Or that his car was shot up and down, I mean, with bullet holes everywhere. Let it be that he's Exactly, alive. exactly, Mazi. And then uh, you are getting towards the answer that I want exactly. to hear. But the thing is that there is still some element of foolishness in our midst. Let me give you one example. Uh, What's his name? Ike Kwaramadu came to Germany for New Year Festival. An Absolutely. old man like that, Remember. who's supposed to teach us mm -hmm. the, the, the tradition, our tradition, that indeed New Year Festival is supposed to be celebrated in our yes. own ancestral land. Then he now traveled Absolutely. to Germany for the, uh, to, to, to mess himself up. Reaching there, the young youth now, now told him, no, sir, your excellency, sir, the New Year Festival is supposed to be celebrated back home. Go back home mm -hmm. and celebrate it. Yes. Go to Enugu, go to our capital, go there and do it. If on the process Hesman kills you, then you will feel what the masses have failed. You know? So after all those scenarios, he went back home. Let me tell you, let me exp let me bring out what I'm trying to say. Reaching home, I watch it on Facebook. A number of youths, Igbo youth that came and gave him alcohol, support him, do him oh yeah, and whatever. Despite what their brothers have tried, take all the risk. You know what it is to live yes. in abroad. Your brother is there, left all, both those who are legal and whatever. They just came out to make sure that you have been uh, taken care by those who are supposed to. Then, on that process, on that note, you still came out to tell your brother in Germany that what they did is nonsense by coming out to give, give him such I call it. I watch it on Facebook. I saw when he was coming back and how if it is yeah. outside people that we are giving jubilating, celebrating that, I wouldn't have worried or Europe. I would say it's politics. But these are called Igbo people. Why will it why will it be that our people will be doing like that? That is why you see the governor you are talking about, the Boeing State, the governor, what's his name? Devil Mai will mess so himself mind. up and whatever, say whatever yeah. you want and still go scot free because he knows that Exactly. What a, at most, he will just ca count no. some uh, notes, you know, and give to the public, and that's all. The same thing his um, predecessor, what's his name, uh, Martin Lechi, did there, yes. you know, yes. the same thing, and he's still he, playing, and he's still playing. Cons consequences, the cost, cost, because, because we never imposed any cost on criminality. So, because he knew he would get away with whatever he says or whatever he, he does, it emboldened, it has become the culture. This Ekwerimado, when he went home and they welcomed him, the people that came there to welcome him knew that nothing will happen. Now, if we had made it uh, a norm that whoever goes against our, our ideals, that we hunt the person that, just like here in the United States, for example, okay? Because, uh, I mean, going against the United States, there, there's, there's a lot of costs that they, they can impose on you. Uh, in, and it will come in so many ways. You wouldn't even know that it's the government responsible for it. They would say he committed a crime and therefore sentenced him accordingly. But in our place, in our land, in our, on the African continent as a whole, 
there's always no consequences for anything. Sub-Saharan Africa, I should say. There's no consequences. So there's no cost. We've never imposed any, any cost on anybody. When uh, this, um, I mean, where do I even, Obiano, for example, the day that he came out and, and, and put a price on the heads of our people, he knew that nothing will happen. Did he not go home at the end of, of, of the day? Go wherever he, sleep, he sleeps? And probably snored in the middle, you know, at night, snored loudly because he knew nothing would happen. But if immediately, if his house had immediately burnt down after that speech, then the next person, would, he would have been in hiding. His house in the village burnt down to ashes. But nothing happened. So he can actually get in his car, patrol, go wherever he wants. I see him uh, take up glasses and, and follow him. Nothing happens until we start imposing costs on criminality, on killing our people, because these people have killed a lot of our people, a whole lot of our people, that they have no, they've lost their right to, to live, every one of them. They have lost the, their, their right to, to exactly, stay continue to exist. Exactly, uh, Mazi, Anen, exactly. You know? Um, well, so, uh, before, just in one or two minutes, before you round off, Mazi, Anen, uh, what advice are you yes, giving sir? to our youth that are listening now uh, regarding all this issue, following politicians, giving them alcohol, welcoming them in the evil they have done, they, are, they have perpetrated, that is causing mayhem to you that is welcoming them, what advice can you give to them uh, before you round up, just in one or two minutes, as we are trying to Absolute. round up the program? Absolutely. Ab absolutely, Marzi. You see, what I, I keep telling our youth, one thing is I want them to have, to develop some mental toughness, to be able to see things in the long run, and not just today, or just me, about me. Because if it was about uh, just uh, personally, uh, a lot of us, we, 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 we could do well in a foreign land. But then that's not our culture. That's not our way of life. We don't die outside. So what I tell them is, one, to maintain, to, to start thinking like human beings, for them not to fall for, for, for these criminals, for them to think in terms of their children and their children after them, because it's going to take people to move things. Things cannot move by themselves. I've said this over and over again. In order to achieve any change, something, ha some, something has to affect something to, achieve, to bring change about. For them not to be thinking in the short term, you know, just giving money, or to think that everything is all hinges in money, that it's all about money, to the extent that when you tell them, here's how you defend yourself, uh, you, you know, you, they almost like, uh, expect you to pay them before they can defend themselves and their households. I ask them to shun these politicians and keep demonstrating in Imo State. Whatever is it going to take, I think we really need to lay a siege on Imo State. We, must, we cannot afford for this criminal to continue, to last even one more day. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Mazanene, you no, have Maze, said it. You I, have I, said it. Thank I, you I, very I much for your wonderful contribution. Thank you very much. And um, God you, bless you for, for calling. God bless you for calling. Thank you very Perfect. much. Thank Perfect. you very much. Um, our people, you have heard it from uh, their brother Mazi Anene. Mental toughness is what is needed. It's one of the key for us to be able to overcome these people. You need it. We need it. Uh, and this is the only way we can overcome uh, 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 these people. Let's use um, Imo State as an example now. Let everybody show his concern in Imo State to make sure that this is a full and pooped did not continue in Imo State because the man has already sold this country, the, the, the entire state already. He has already, who knows the, 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 the kind of agreement he has with them before they agree with him. And he has started fishing out. Just a few days ago, Emir of Imo State, you know, was installed, which we have never had before. There is nothing that consigned Imo State with Emir. There is nothing that concerns... Emir is not indigenous to Imo State. Such a name is not supposed to be mentioned within that region because it is not indigenous to us. You know? But this is what...
the governor now is installing to tell us what is going on. And if we keep quiet on this, then the remaining one will be coming out gradually. So our dear youths, the message is for all of us to wake up. Don't buy, don't accept all this for one naira, two naira, three thousand naira, five thousand they give you. You sell your future. Let everybody insist. Let everybody stand. Stand up for the truth. Even if that um, court did not, we all of us will refuse. If if possible, we'll go on strike. I am not in, I am not, we are not partisan here. We are not supporting any party. But this one, we have seen the evil coming out. Let's use Imo State as an example so that other ones will know that indeed we have awakened. Very, very important. So that this kind of nonsense will not continue. It will continue. I wonder the kind of mentality, the kind of understanding our people have. I wonder the kind of spell or cause, will I say, that have been pronounced up, uh, upon us. Ojo Zokalo is in prison, despite all the good job he did to Afusa Fulani. Even to the extent that we heard that his father could come from there or whatever. I don't know all those kind of things. But this man served them faithfully. Theodore carried all the assignment of Afusa Fulani. Today, where is he? Is it a metal? Our leader have said this thing several times. Serve them and return back shamefully. Serve them and return back shamefully. They will disgrace you. But still, these things are still going on. Is Hope also telling me that even if he sell him a state to them, that he will be free? The answer is no. Why would we be so stupid like this? What is happening to us? It's time we wake up. IPOB has come. IPOB is light. Our leader, Mazin Namdekano, is a chosen one. Because if not him, by now, I, don't, I wonder what will be happening. We, some of us might not even know, understand the game. We won't, because somebody will be talking, even you will just be there and say, brother, you are saying, in fact, you are causing problem. Let him be. Because despite so far, IPOB has gone. Some people still don't understand what is happening. Then imagine if there is nothing like IPOB. Imagine if the, this is a gift of century, like our leader, Mazin Namdekano, was not given. Imagine where we would have been. So let's wake up. Join IPOB. Be part of IPOB. Be part of what we are doing. If you have not joined IPOB, you make sure you join. You can join IPOB in any local you are in any territory you are in any country you are in any state you are there is ipob all over the world look for them look for the unit belong to there and begin to give your support my dear brother my dear sister your support is needed it is not just only registering some people will go register attend one meeting and they will not they will not uh, 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 continue. Some people will go there. They won't uh, come back again. It's not like that. It's not like that. Because what is before us is very dangerous. If you don't give the necessary support needed from you, what is before us will eat us. IPOB has the only key that will you know, open that door for you. IPOB is the only medicine that can cure this madness. IPOB, if it is an Aosa, IPOB is the only magani that can solve that problem. So that is why you support IPOB under the leadership of Onyen Dumazin Namdekano. He has the key, he has the understanding. He knows all the game they are planning. So be part of IPOB. Be part of IPOB. Support what they are doing. Give your support. Give your support. When I'm talking support, attend meetings, give contribution, and give your money. Money is very, very important. Money is necessary in anything we are doing. If you are not paying your dues, if you are not paying the levy you are asked to do, how can the movement move forward? We don't want to be corrupt. We don't want to associate with any politician. We don't want any of their thing. Because the moment they come in, the entire system will be corrupt. Our leader has been remained incorruptible from day one. And so shall he.
until the end. So you will make it to work by giving your money. Support IPOB in all area you are. Give your own contribution. Give your money. Money is needed. Your money is needed. Give your contribution. Wake up from where you are. Because if you don't wake up, something will come and wake you up. Give your money. If you don't give, somebody, something will come and take your blood and as well your money. So it's better you give money than losing your blood. Better give up that money in exchange of your blood. Because if you don't, definitely both your land, your blood, your money, everything will be taken away without sorry. And you will never be remembered. So my dear brothers, this is Radio Biafra Outer Service 2. Mm. Under the platform of Radio Biafra London, being deputized by the only good man, Mazi Uchemefo, and under the leadership of Mazi Namdikano Ohamadike Wan of Biafra Land, whom Elohim has chosen for this struggle. And he is the director of Radio Biafra and Television. And we are his disciples. I am watching is one of his disciples. So we are here to propagate. We are here to give the message. We are here for the restoration of Biafra and the liberation of the entire African race from these shenanigans that whatever brought it to us, I don't know, has given. IPOB Biafra is here to set us free. Let us understand the truth. Let us know what is happening and let us join the movement by this time now we'll start to be rounding up and i ask you to join us uh, tomorrow by the same time we will be coming to you get prepared our number has been given and the number is there as time goes on we will continue to give more number and other um, devices that you can use to get us Maybe if you can call the number, you can call WhatsApp, Skype, and whatever, it will be open later. But we really appreciate you, our listeners, and uh, those who called. Malan Isam Mohammed, I thank you very much for, cont for your contribution. Malan Shetima, I thank you. Uh, Mazi Anene, I thank you. And Abubaka from Sokoto. Malam Abubaka from Sokoto, thank you so much. And uh, there this sister that called from Iwocha, though uh, network did not permit you to give your contribution, we really appreciate. We thank you so much, and uh, we pray that God Almighty will continue to protect each and every one of us. We will be rounding up. <laughs> Take my boots off when I die. Oh, Biafra. Take my clothing to the camp. Hallelujah, give my gun to someone else to fight for fatherland. Biafra, take my boots off when I die. Oh, Juku Beze, na la Biafra. Edere ya na buri. Awolo wo wane ya ya kubu go wan. Biafra, Biafra win the war. Amodu Kasheli machine, heavy and clary, bomb and fighter. Enye muga wa wanting to get my boy e we no nu. Enye muga wa wanting to get. Enye muga wa wanting to get my boy e we no nu. Enye muga wa wanting to get. Umu Biafra, unde kwe kwa na kago wa chuno. Unde <laughs> Where 
Thank you very much, our listeners. Uh, we thank you very much. Whatever that has beginning has an end. We'll be ending our program today. Not that we are ending final, but we are ending for the day. Um, we'll bring the program to an end. We thank each and every one of you for listening, for calling, and uh, we ask you as well to let your neighbor know that um, we are on air or always on air at this time. So you join us, you come and make your contribution. We are here for the truth and nothing for the truth. And I wish to remind us that our leader, Mazin Namdikano, who has given us the power to do what we are doing, uh, will be live today by 7 p.m. Biafra Land time. 7 p.m. Biafra Land time. Make sure you put all your devices ready so that you will listen to the gospel is bringing to the world thank you very much as we close with a word of prayer heavenly father we thank you we bless you we glorify your name lord we thank you for this wonderful day we thank you for making it possible that we were able to do what you asked us to do lord it's not by our power it's not by our might but by your grace Father, we ask you to continue to pour your grace upon us Help us, O Lord God Jehovah, that we will not fall. Even the weaker ones in our midst, Lord, we pray that you will strengthen them. Let them wake up. Those who are still arguing, those who are still sleeping, those who don't understand what we are doing, Lord, we pray that this word we are speaking will waken up their mind, that they will come to understanding to join, so that this freedom we are fighting for will finally come because when this freedom come it will help them as well father we thank you we bless you we glorify your name we commit every ipod into your hand wherever they are we pray for their protection we also pray for their provision as well my lord and my god because without you we can do nothing so we ask you our father jehovah to be with them, be with our leader, be with his family, and be with each and every one of us. Even those who call us their enemy, whereby we are good people to them, we have good intention. Father, bless them, but let them realize that indeed we are their Messiah, not their enemy. Thank you, blessed Lord. Thank you, Abba Father, as you remain at God in heaven. Father, we end this prayer in the mighty name of your beloved son, Yeshua HaMashiach. Bye.
Jesus.